I'm hungry. Oh. After film was saying, oh, I've got no food, I need to go get some, but I can't even lie, like, <laughs> I got plenty of snackies and stuff in here. I just wanted to give myself more reason to actually go and get it. I know, I'm a fraudster. Oh god, it's so hot. Where am I going for food? I'm going to a vending machine. If you know anything about Japan, you know there's vending machines everywhere. Especially if you saw my last video, uh, I saw a very questionable one, uh, an adult one if you will. I've been wanting to go to this one for a good while now, so I thought today, you know, it's the day. Ooh. I'm approaching it now, here it is. So here is the vending machine in the flesh, literally, <laughs> I'm so funny. Um, but this is a meat vending machine. And that is the one that I'm going to get, but we'll get to that in a second. So there's actually two different meat vending machines here. This one's more of like a kebab one, um, and there's a lot of pork options in there. I'm more interested in this one. So the one that I pointed at just before, this is raw horse meat. We've even got a little brochure showing you a little, little horse on it, so you know what you're getting. So it's not as weird as you might think. So these vending machines are actually right next to a whole butchery. So you know you're getting good meat. So all of the meat in here is from that butchery and it's just another way for them to sell their products when their stores close. So how much did this cost me? So 12,000 yen, which is roughly around $12. So not terrible, but also not the best. I mean, I don't actually know how much horse meat is really worth, but I mean, that's how much I paid for it. Wow. And there we go, we got it. We got some uh, some raw horse meat. So yeah, we got, we got the goods. So it actually looks like it's frozen. So I guess they kind of do that so they can keep the meat in there for as long as they can, because you know, who, who's buying this often? Now I have actually had horse meat before, but just not from here. Um, it's this area's local dish, apparently. Interesting thing about this meat, um, well it's frozen now, but once it defrosts, you're actually supposed to eat it raw. So once this defrosts, uh, we're gonna give it a little sample, a little review. Back at the house now, so I'm just gonna wait for this to defrost. It might take an hour or two, um, and then we'll give it a little taste test. Oh, oh, oh. She's looking fresh. Let's dig in. So I've got myself a little bit of soy sauce to dip it in. Look at it. Mm. Time for the moment of truth. <laughs> uh, not gonna lie, I'm a little bit nervous about eating this. I need a haircut, god damn. To horse meat. I really hope this is the stuff you don't cook. Actually, pretty decent. I'm gonna have more. I was ready for this to be disgusting, but it's actually pleasantly, surprisingly good.